Manners is a I've, I've been to Nat thing. all day. <laughs> oh, it's 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 they used to be. I didn't even like it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, guys. <laughs> We used to be ashamed of that, but I think we've lost all shame now waiting for them. The camera might get six, they used to be. Give me the first person while we're done with it. We've got rebels and nuts. That's what we can Oh, okay. Yes, oh. Right? Are we friends? Shit, am I taking your seat then? Oh, no? Well, yes, but that's good. Yeah, that's good. Okay. okay. <laughs> awesome. Wait, let me put this. I'm not going to eat. Right, guys, we have Molly from Ireland. Questions for Molly. Hello! I can't eat at the same time. What's in your sandwich? <laughs> I don't know. Is it nice? <laughs> I'm just eating it. I don't know what it is. <laughs> it's lonely. It's like a vegetarian thing. No, somebody got it from me. How diva is that? Someone got me with that. Um, yeah. Right, it's so my sandwich. Let's see. What are you eating? <laughs> Hi, How difficult was it to make it such a career jump in such a short time? Um, it wasn't difficult. Uh, it's an honor. Like, I, it's, it's, I've been working on an album for the last year, and I just needed we needed this platform, like a, like a jump, like a leap pad. Um, hopefully, the fans from the Orbit will stick with me um, for the album. So yeah. What's the genre of the album? Uh, the genre? Yeah. I don't know yet. Yeah. I tell you, I write a lot of dark lyrics, so expect dark, gothic, probably lyrics. But it's fairly easy listening. You're probably... It's all really sad, though. Some of it's really depressing. But I like it. <laughs> well, that's a very, very important question. Are you single? They're already hitting on you. I'm married to music, guys. Come on. <laughs> no, yes, I'm single, but, like, come on, no. Have you had any advice from any previous Irish entrants? Yeah. I said, don't let the Eurovision define you, which was great because I was worried about that because it's a singer song right here. You're seen, you know, I don't want to be seen as like a singer sitting on the stage. Like the team behind me are unbelievable. I genuinely won't be able to do it without them. And we're all friends, like we're like a little family. Um, yeah, I forgot the question. I'm scrambling now, sorry, so it's distracting me. <laughs> What's your favorite entry from this year other than yours? Norway. I love that. Oh, I'm not up there anymore. I love that song. God, it's such a good song. Oh, it's unreal. And so if you could sing that song, who would you sing it with? If you could pick anyone in the world to be the guy. Oh, well, who would a usual girl pick? Probably like if Kurt Cobain was still alive, but I don't know if he'd do that. <laughs> you can you could bring it back from the dead. You can Anybody looks like Kurt Cobain and can sing all of me. <laughs> I'm afraid of the guitar, you know one. <laughs> Sorry. No worries. Stepping on your toes, Eric. How do you think you will react when you qualify? When I qualify? I like the confidence of these, um, <laughs> these viewers. Um, it's going to be fun. It's going to be an interesting night and a worse day after. <laughs> um, no, I, I just, I, lads, like seriously, I didn't even think I'd get to be here, like, so this is ridiculous. Like, I'm just totally walking on cloud nine, and I'm eating a sandwich and, oh gosh, anyway, <laughs> nothing's embarrassing anymore. Uh, have you built any bridges with other contestants yet? I, have you met them? Have you, you know, um, <laughs> really? Just clarifying that, that they're not going there, because these, these people can be quite nasty. So. Have I built any bridges? Um, we were hanging out with Latvia. <laughs> Who gets to say that? Like, hanging out with Latvia, yeah, they're good. Uh, with Aminata, she's cool. Uh, but I haven't really, apart from that, I don't think. I think we're doing like a go kart race with the Latvians and the Lithuanians, so that's gonna be fun. We're gonna kick their ass. And they were like talking dirt talking about our go kart skills. That's not happening, that's not okay. We can go kart with the rest of them, okay? Alright? Sorry. Uh, what's your that's favorite song you. ever? Oh, I don't have a favorite. That's like asking me. No, it's not asking me. Um, the one at the moment was in my head, you know, Lady by Stevie Nicks. That song gets me every time, and I, I just cry, like ball crying. It's really good. Anyway, yeah. Do you have any lucky charm? Ah, this necklace I never take off. Um, I believe that it's some sort of voodoo kind of thing. Like it's my, I can't, I can't take it off, and uh, I say little mantras to it. And this ring I don't take off, and this bracelet. I, I just feel like sentimental stuff. But like my lucky charm is supposed to sound so cheesy, but they're my team. Like the team behind me, we're, we're literally a family. 
I literally feel like I have three more sisters, two more brothers, and then like uncles and stuff. It's, it's, it's amazing. Mm, You're watching this live. Why did you decide to take part in the Irish national final? We kind of touched on that already, but... Yeah, yeah. Do you want me to go over again? Yeah. What? <laughs> <laughs> uh, um, the revamp gave the song, the song a little boom. Do you prefer it in the original or the, uh, the new one? I would... I would... It's like... It's a, it's a kid of mine. It's a child. So... I don't care if it's just me on the piano. Not that I don't care, but... Like... I love playing it with just the piano, I love playing it with all the oomph, uh, it's amazing. Like on that stage, you see those lights? <laughs> ridiculous, there's lights all around the stage. Uh, I used to play in school and assembly, like this is ridiculous, like, sorry. This is There's bad. a question for me, on your first rehearsal, mm -hmm. yeah. after you finished the first run, uh, we could see on the screen that someone came and talked to you and started so, like, giving you pointers, it seems. Today? No, on the very, very first one. Probably Greg. Do you remember why it was? Because it seemed like afterwards you started doing a little bit more eye contact with the camera, which we didn't see at first. I probably connect more with the camera. I'm used to just closing my eyes and be like, no, no, my world, shutting it out, shutting it out. <laughs> but uh, apparently you have to connect with people. So, uh, yeah, I was looking at the camera, it works like... I, I don't really ever say no too much. Like, I'm, <laughs> that's kind of probably dangerous to say. Um, but I'm fairly open-minded, so like... You know, looking at the camera was a difficult kind of thing because I'm not very like that, but I, li I like it. That, is the stage a little bit too big or would you rather have a more intimate atmosphere? I don't think it matters where you are. Like, me and the guys, they're all unbelievable musicians and singers. Like, me and the guys in the apartment were jamming till like 5 in the morning the other night and that was amazing. Playing on the stage is amazing. No, I think it's a good size. Like, it's usually a lot bigger now. Like it's usually not bigger, right? It's quite big. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, yeah, it's, it's nice, like it's a little circle. I love the lights around it. No, no, the stage is perfect. Everything's perfect. <laughs> I complain about anything. <laughs> about your, your backdrop and your staging, did you choose it or...? Um... Um, did I choose it? No, like, we, well, everybody chose it. Like, I went to the production meet too, like, we have a team. And amazing people on lights and Greg had a lot of input on that as well. Um, so, no, I mean, the trees, I just have a weird thing. Like, I love butterflies and trees. Like, there's black butterflies on my top. I'm not going to go into the black butterfly thing right now. It's like a mantra thing of mine, but you don't have time for that. Trust me. So, yeah, the trees and the... the we're just, yeah, just trying to keep it intimate and real, like, authentic, you know? Because, like, it's, it's, it's the song the lyrics. What came first, the melody or the lyric? <laughs> I don't remember. I remember I brought Greg, like the song um, like the bones of it kind of like the chorus like there was like give a little love thing. and then there was like some verse but I had a little piano if it wasn't great great totally like it was totally a 50-50 team thing I think when I think of a lyric most of the time like a lot of the time I just write lyrics or thoughts but like when I thought of those lyrics I think I thought of one line I think it was like, or something and it was just the lyric the melody came with the lyric but usually Greg is like king of melody okay lyrics <laughs> right guys we need to ramp it up we need to let Molly go finish her, um, her lunch uh, so thanks very much oh, guys oh, thank you thank you thanks a million that was, that's kind of like creepy that thing <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah. 10 hours